Okay, um, let's solve number eight. And now I'm going to try to get rid of, um, show you two ways. Um, the first one, we're going to try to get rid of um, the x. So to get rid of the x, this needs to be positive 12. To get it to a positive 12, we multiply the entire equation by 2. And so we end up with a 12x minus 8y equals negative 8. Okay, when we do that, we have the x's becoming 0 and then a negative 6y equals a negative 6. Divide both sides by negative 6, so y equals 1. Okay, um, I can put that back into my first equation. So I get a 6x minus 4 times 1 equals negative 4. And a 6x minus 4 equals negative 4. We're going to add 4 to both sides. So we get a 0 on this side. Divide both sides by 6. So x equals 0. So our answer is 0, negative 1. Okay, um, if we decide to get rid of the y, the y's, you notice that multiply this by a 2, that should um, make that 4y, and then subtract it with the 4y, and that should give you the 0. So we have a negative 24x plus 4y equals 4. We'll bring the second equation underneath it. Okay, we're going to add the 2. So we have a negative 24 plus 6, which is a negative 18x. We have a positive 4y and a negative 4y that's going to give you a 0. And a 4 minus 4, which is going to give you a 0. Divide both sides by negative 18. So x equals 0. And then when you put it into one of the equations, you're going to get the same y. Okay, and good job.